guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be comparing the Mini Amber and the Full Size Amber. So today we're going to be looking at the features of the Amber and we're going to be packing them both up so then you can see the size difference between them. Sorry the bag was a little squish, it's empty at the moment and the way I stored it I was kind of, I kind of flattened it a little but it will pop out a bit once um, I pack it up. So let's look at its features. So at the very front here is a mummy pocket and it's quite a large pocket and it has um, one, two, three, four card slots, two pen holders and a slip pocket here. And that's the carry kit um, lining. It's embossed with the carry kit logo. It's waterproof, really nice champagne color. So the amber has these side pockets. Now they don't look like your traditional bottle pockets, but these pockets are great um, to put like med kit, your phone, your wallet. And it looks like that. So one side of the zipper goes up to about here and the other side goes a lot lower. It opens quite wide so you can fit quite a lot in there. When you turn the bag around, these are the beautiful backpack straps. You've got two luggage straps here, one at the top, one at the bottom. Zip pocket on the side here and it goes to about here to the bag and a larger one that goes all the way to here. So this is quite a large one. Also comes with D-rings on the side so you can attach it to your stroller. Okay, so let's have a look inside the bag. So when you open it up, you've got the same lining and it looks like this. Okay, so at the very back you have a slip pocket with a zipper closure. It's just a plastic zip, nice and smooth. And you've got the carry kit um, name here. This is all leather trim. And on the inside it's just a pocket that goes almost to the bottom of the bag. And on the sides you have um, bottle pockets. These ones are not insulated. But if you want to keep anything cool or warm, you would use these pockets because they are insulated. Key leash here with a button clip. And here's a close up of the Carry Kit um, logo and the zipper pulls look like this. Really cute. So you've got the Carry Kit logo on one side and then this is just like a nice gold stud. So here's a close-up look of the Kerry Kit leather. It's pebbled, but it's not like overly um, textured. It still feels quite smooth. This leather feels really luscious and soft. So here is my midi amber in the color Antique Rose packed up for my two girls. Um, Alicia is still formula fed, so she still needs quite a few things. So we're gonna unpack the midi amber and put it into the amber. So let's have a look how I've got this one packed up right now. So the very front pocket here, it's got the same organization as the full size amber that I showed you earlier. I keep my poppy wallet from carry kits. In the side pockets here, on one side I decided to keep a small set piece and this just has all my personal um, things in there just for me and on this side I decided to keep it empty so when you turn the bag around you have your beautiful backpack straps you've got the two straps one at the top one at the bottom exactly the same as the full-size amber for your luggage and you have a zip pocket here and a larger one here let's have a look at what it looks like on the inside I've just adjusted the angle of the camera. Hopefully you can see inside the bag a lot better. So let's have a look how I have got it packed up. So when you open this up, I'm just going to pop the flap into the grab handle so it doesn't keep flopping down. One thing I wanted to mention is the two front pockets on the inside here is not insulated, but the two on the side here is insulated. Whereas on the full size amber, it's the opposite. Okay, so just sitting in the main compartment here, I have my Contigo um, travel mug and I keep hot water to make formula. I have a uh, formula container. Also in the main compartment, I have the Be Quick um, packed with two outfits for Alicia and one for Haley. Sitting in front of the Be Quick is a med kit. As you can see, 
I've utilized the side pockets to put bottles. Um, like I said, they're insulated. So this one here is for Alicia. And the one on the left hand side is a container for Haley. Um, so in this laptop or iPad sleeve here, I have um, two pull ups for Haley, one, two, three um, nappies for Alicia, size three, and a thin change pad from GGB, one of those that you get with the Hobo V. And I have a wipe pouch um, 30 with baby wipes. So at the top here, you've got a um, key leash. It looks um, different to the one on the full size amber. So the full size amber had like a button closure, like I showed you with a ring, where this already has like a lobster clip thing. And at the back here, you've got a um, zip pocket exactly the same as the full size amber with uh, leather trim and the carry kit name. I didn't pack anything in here. So I wanted to quickly mention also that in the um, midi size amber you have this iPad um, sleeve that is padded with a um, button closure here. So in the full size amber you don't have this feature. I had a question also if the um, iPad Pro will fit into the midi amber and the full size amber. So I don't actually own an iPad Pro but I did look up the measurements and I found something similar. So pretend this is an iPad Pro. Now, I did try this once and I tried to put it into this back slip pocket. It was, it fits, but it is quite a bit of work to get in and out. So, I'm going to try and push it in for you and show you. And I worry that it will wreck my zips. As you can see, I had to like squish it in, but it does fit. So if you um, wanted to pack an iPad Pro, I would suggest just slotting it in this way and then pushing it right under this here and then it just sits like that rather than into the laptop sleeve because I feel like it just takes a little bit more work to get it in there. So this is the full size amber packed up with everything that I packed in the midi amber. So let's have a look how I have it packed up. So in the front pocket here, I kept my uh, med kit for myself and my poppy wallet. I haven't packed anything in my two side pockets at all. I just kept them empty. Same with at the back. So as you can see, there is quite a lot of room. You can fit easily um, some jackets, blankets, extra pouches. I haven't even used all the pockets in this bag. So like I said, I didn't use these two side pockets. I didn't pack anything at the back here. Um, and everything else fit really nicely. So I've just got the nappies sitting um, back to back in the main compartment. I'm gonna pull those out. And then I have the change pad and the wipe pouch right next to it. Right next to the nappies is the, the clip with the clothes. And then I have the med kit as well, right next to that. And now I'm left with this, and this is what it looks like. So on the left hand side here, I have the um, frontainer. So like I said, these two side pockets here are not insulated, but the ones at the front here are. So um, I don't mind putting my thermal containers in those pockets because these are going to do the job anyway. So here's my Contigo travel mug. When I turn the bag around, I have in the two insulated pockets, one is Alicia's milk bottle and in the other, the formula container. And that is it. So you can see that the full size amber is quite large compared to the mini amber. Once again, my pretend iPad Pro. Let's see how it fits into the full size amber. It's going to go in perfectly. So that fits nice and easily. But like I said, it doesn't come with a um, laptop or iPad uh, sleeve. Kerry has designed it for it to go at the back. So let's see how it fits at the back. So if it goes this way it's probably too long and I don't think it's going to fit this way either so that's quite surprising um, so it looks like the iPad Pro um, I believe it's bigger than the normal standard iPad um, 
it doesn't fit in here unless you pop it into the main compartment um, but with the uh, midi amber it fits into the laptop sleeve with a little bit of work or you can just pop it in exactly the same as the full size amber I also wanted to point out that the backpack straps are different in width so the full size amber is wider than the midi amber the ambers are very popular bags and I believe some of the colours are already sold out and Carry Kit is actually on sale at the moment with 20% off and the full size amber actually comes in a nylon as well. So for me personally, I actually love the ambers. I love both sizes. I feel like I need both or want both. Um, I think the midi is super cute. Right now, I do need to pack quite a lot because my kids are still quite young, but I'm still able to make the midi amber work for me. And I have used the full size amber for traveling before and I found it really, really comfortable. I've packed it full, uh, carried it all around with me all day and I didn't have any problems at all. I love that these bags don't look like nappy bags and that I can use it for every season of my life. She has quite a few colors to choose from. I know that they've been selling out pretty quick, um, but every season Carrie does bring out new colors and different types of leathers. So anyway, um, I'll leave it there. Thank you so much for tuning in again. I hope you found this video helpful and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.